Minneapolis, Minnesota, run downtown, the beautiful Minneapolis downtown skyline. It's awesome. It's a little muggy today. It's early in the AM. Looks like it might rain a little bit later, so I just want to get my riding in. I'm super excited. It's that time of the year. I mean, I love riding, but it's football time. Coming from Minnesota, I'm a big Vikings fan. So super excited. Just base basically off all the hype coming off of last year, losing to Seattle with that missed field goal. Very, very sad. So yeah, just wanted to ride downtown to go check out the new stadium and see what it looks like from the outside. And we have the Target field to the right here. Where the Twins play. It's a nice field too. Um, yeah, heading downtown. Super excited. So just hopefully the Vikings do well this year. We got our new stadium that our tax dollars have been going to. And oh, yellow light. It was yellow. It was yellow. I didn't even speed up for it, alright? Don't judge me. Oh, that's yellow, but that bus is going too. That bus is going too. And he was blocking me. Alright. Let me get so many comments. Just kidding. I have no. I will not have any comments at all. I have no subscribers. So. It is what it is. Um, I can see the stadium. U.S. Bank Stadium. It's straight ahead. It's that little slanted thing right there. Gonna ride down town. It's so dead. It's hey Vikings fans. Yeah. Um it's so dead. Usually it's a lot more busy. I come down here in the evenings for dinner and, and during the weekends. To have a drink or two or three or a few. There goes a the new Vikings. U.S. Bank Stadium. It's, it's going to be awesome. I can't wait to go inside there. I guess there's going to be a, a soccer game soon here. Um, so they're going to use it in a lot of different ways besides just for the Vikings. That's where my uh, tax dollars are going to. And I... Don't mind at all. I'm a big Vikings fan. I don't give a hoot. Oh, that thing looks awesome. And I guess they put a film on there to just kind of lower the amount of birds that are being killed. They're, they're flying into the glass. Poor birdies. So watch where you're going, though. It may look clear. You shouldn't just fly right into there. Oh yeah, that thing is awesome. I'm so excited. Hopefully, you know, they could advance farther in the playoffs this year. Bring a Super Bowl. I'm a fan, so I I'm always hoping for a Super Bowl, no matter how whatever year or however they did the year before. Got to be optimistic, stay positive. Yeah, there's a lot of people heading towards the uh, stadium. I guess they're doing tours and stuff. Um, I want to go inside. Everyone's going inside, except for that lady. She's probably playing Pokemon Go. Yeah, her. Trying to catch some Pokemons. Yeah, there go. That's our light rail system right there. Never been on it, but I'd like to try it sometime. That'd be awesome. Oh no, this is gonna be a longer light. No. Yeah, definitely something going on right now. I know they're giving tours out, but um, it's officially open. They had a little ceremony, a ribbon cutting. 
That's the Purple Palace. Where the Vikings will live for a long time. Super excited. Oh man, I just have no idea. Just taking it in a moment, just looking at it. It's so beautiful. And this is the longest light ever. So let's just take a moment and enjoy the view. Alright, I'm done. Let's, come on. I'm over this. Let's go. Let's go light. There we go. Let's go. Let's go, Vikings. Let's go. Okay. There are like no lanes at all. Kind of. No, no, there's no lanes. You don't know where I'm going. Where is that guy going? Okay. Yeah, I definitely gotta go check out the tour or whatever they're doing here. It'd be awesome just to see what it's like inside the stadium because I don't obviously when, if I go to a game I don't want to be walking around during the game just to see the place what is this little area right here entrance to the back cave that's the only reasonable explanation that's definitely goes to the back cage I mean cave or probably where the players go through the little security entrance. Let's go around again. One more time, just gonna see the other side. I mean, that thing is beautiful, it's big. Can't wait. I'm glad I'm out riding right now. Gotta get my fix. You guys know how it is. We need to ride. It's so gloomy. I'm gonna head right back downtown again. Check it out from the other side. You know, this is basically telling you a little bit more about myself. Letting you come into my world, showing you things that I like besides motorcycles. I love motorcycles and I love riding. But obviously we all have other hobbies and interests that are into besides motorcycles. And it's okay. It's good to be well cultured and well versatile. Look at that skyline, isn't that beautiful? Minneapolis is a beautiful city. You guys can come and check it out sometime for those who've never been. And for those who have, you know what I'm talking about. Downtown, going downtown. On her, or go downtown on me. Skyscrapers. Yes, it looks so weird. It's so dead right now. Usually, there's just people walking around. Erwin.
who do I need to know to get into that stadium? Oh, we stopped way, way early, buddy. Like two car lengths. Injured? It's TSA. Something. Uh, let's go here. Okay. We're good. A lot of construction. Getting hungry. I wonder if they're serving like hot dogs in there already. You know, something. Nachos. I want some stadium food. Something about that food is just. No matter how good of a cook you are, it's just. You can't duplicate those hot dogs some, for some reason. It's like, what the heck? What do they do with those hot dogs? How do they do it? Is it even real meat? Who knows? They're just so damn good. Man, I'm so hyped. You don't even know. Just riding around for no reason because I'm hyped. Riding around this stadium looking like an idiot. I'm so hyped. Hyped. Wishing I could be one of those fans walking around the stadium. Alright, we're almost there. I promise. Other side. Oh, um, see, see, see? I could have I could have made it. I could have made it. Safety first. Safety first. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, green light. Green light. The car he's headed for, he wants to go to. Oh, is he waving at me? Uh, okay. Thank you. Sure, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Off. Oh, my bike is so slow. So slow. People ahead. Oh, okay. Here's the other side of it. That's awesome. See how it's slanted? So I guess the snow doesn't stay on there and it slides off. In theory. Who knows? We'll see if it works. We get a lot of snow, and if you guys don't, if you guys remember, um, the Metrodome collapsed because we had so much snow. It like the, the caved in. That was pretty weird. I didn't think it happened, but it happened. In the last couple seasons, we've been at TCF stadium where the gophers play and that's the last time i was there for a game was the actual seattle game where we lost in the heartbreak it was super cold it, oh my goodness. it was below i think it was like the coldest playoff game or maybe one of the coldest or something i'm not sure but it was cold so i'm glad i won't have to deal with that this season i'll be in that motherfucker purple palace U.S. Bank Stadium, where the Vikings are going to win it, win it all, and the Super Bowl is going to be here too, I don't, I don't know, I think it's like 2018 season, I'm not sure, or maybe, is it next season, next season or season after, but yeah, the Super Bowl is going to be here, so the stadium is bringing a lot of different things to Minneapolis, Minnesota here. Minnesota in general. So I'm super pumped. 
hopefully, you know, we have a good year. And, yeah, just wanted to share that with everyone. Um, thanks for watching. Um, please subscribe. Um, comment. Thumbs up. Uh, you know, comment what you want me to do. Again, I'm from Minnesota, so if you want to see, like, the Mall of America, you want to see me riding around somewhere, I can definitely do that. Just let me know. Alright, thanks for watching. Have a good one.